Hey, hello guys, it's me again, Off Android 26. Uh, I hope you like that intro. Uh, it's something I did with things that I found in the internet. A great song, a uh, great picture. Links will be down below in the description. As always, and as, a, as everything I do, I put tons of links in the description. Now, I'm going to talk about this elegant, sweet UI. Uh, it, it was something that I decided to do. It's not that special. Now let's begin with this widget. This widget is called Bob Glock D3. Uh, mm -hmm. And it, it's here. You can customize the color of the hours and the transparency here. Let's put it blue and with Nick and and the transparency right here and the minutes will be red <laughs> with no transparency uh, no. here now select the color you can choose lowercase or or not for the date you can choose the date layout nothing too fancy but can always change it the text size Small, normal, large, and very large. You can choose 24 hour display or 12 hour display. Fast English, even though your device is not running, um, not using the English language, you can now force the, the English language. And if you tap in the clock, it will launch the clock. Confirm. And this is our widget. Uh, Amir. I've got a, a very weird layout, as you can see. <laughs> and it's nothing too hard to do. And I. It's basically a two page home screen with. No, not here. With um, a strange grid size, the grids it's um, eight by f six, and in this way the things may appear a little bit shrinked and and messed up. So you can always resize your widget as always, and don't forget to don't forget to to do some arrangements because it's a strange grid size and your device not ready for that. Now the live wallpaper is called Bezier or Bezier Bezier? I don't know. And you can mess up with settings, talking you can go to default settings, the number of lines, how much they are spread, step size our velocity of lines and now just changing little things I like the blur effect uh, it makes things pretty cool you can also change the background color the color cycling themes themes are pretty good you can always stick with those themes if you like more blue you can go and choose the blue theme if you prefer red we have the red and orange theme now lots of choice here and pretty cool very cool really love this live wallpaper now next thing i'm going to talk about all, all of the icons to the end <laughs> now next thing i'm talking about is this widget it's from weather eye it's nothing too fancy just some customization I can show you in a second so whether I or it is this is the forecast widget you can here change the current location and you can add a location you can change the icons there are tons of them and they are all pretty sexy oh I never saw this <laughs> Pretty, pretty cool. Now, what I was using was climb my guns light. You can also change the text color to matching your to match your 
Here I comes round corners. Edit dots to go straight to this configuration page and show refresh button. If you don't want to show if you I mean if you, if you don't include your edit dots if you have if you want to change your widget you have to delete it and now it's not running pretty well. You already know this bar is power toggles or something like it's power toggles and you know how to create it. I have a video when I explain everything about this. So let's delete this one and use this one. Now let's talk about these icons, these fancy new icons. What are they? This is an application called Da -da 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 -da. Metro Station and it's basically an icon application it doesn't do much here just shows you your icon your icons you can the icons you can use and it's really cool you can change the color and the image for every icon so I'm going add and edit this Google Chrome icon there are not many icons but there are some of them like messaging oh where am I hey Google so it's maybe in Chrome mm, okay here it is you can basically choose your icon the um, color for it let's go ahead and choose a red I think and you can choose the transparency of the icon and boom you're ready to go nothing too fancy as you can see but good enough I like my default icon for Google Chrome so you can do this for every app I have this very colorful but mostly dark user interface it's pretty cool it, the dark thing helps me out a lot with battery and it's very minimalistic very elegant and very colorful you know it's mostly dark but very colorful when you see all those colors and and it's pretty cool I I do like the Google Drive the Google Chrome and the S node icons icons and if I didn't I only had the choice to change the Google Chrome icon as you saw so Folders with catch, studios and sooner scribble available in the Samsung Store. My file manager, the Play Store, they don't have the Play Store icon. You can, you must have, you must use the um, Android Market icon, Tasks, and Scan. This is also icon from Metro Station. Tesla LED and Screen Filter. Nothing too fancy, so I hope you like this new look. It's amazing, it's sexy. I had this look in my AEW Launcher EX while running Gingerbread, but it was a little bit slow with couple a couple of widgets or three widgets, I don't remember, and the live wallpaper. So you try. Nothing too fancy, but can go ahead and and try it yourself if you like stick with it if you don't just change go back to your normal thing and just try okay I hope you like this video please give it a thumbs up I know you will subscribe thanks for sharing this video this is actually my fourth video if you have any suggestions write it down below comment I don't know, send me an email for Alphandroid26, follow me on Twitter and uh, Alphandroid26, everything's on Alphandroid26. Okay, so Alphandroid26 at gmail.com and Alphandroid26 for my Twitter account. Comment down below, send me suggestions, thanks for watching and see you next video. Goodbye.